everyone, it's Shelby from WW11Mama. This week, I am going to ask for questions from you guys, if you have any questions whatsoever, and I'll get into that in a little bit. First up, I am a travel agent who specializes in Disney, Disney World, Disneyland, Disney Cruises, Disneyland Paris, Adventures by Disney. So if you have any questions, please let me know. If there's any background noise that you are hearing, just please ignore it. It's my cat and my dog playing together. It's raining here, so they apparently have gone insane. Um, <laughs> so, yes, yeah, so I specialize in everything Disney. I love the planning process, the itineraries, everything like that. That's my favorite. Dining, fast passes, that is my, like, that's the stuff that I love to do the best. So if you have not booked your trip yet, please contact me. I have made my list for 2020. The list is growing. So if you're interested in going in 2020 and would like a quote as soon as they come out, Contact me as well. My email is at the end of this video as well as down below. And that is all. All right, so let's get into this video. This video is budget travel to Disney World. So if you have any questions about the best time to go for your money, uh, best resorts to stay at for your family and for your money, the best dining, if you want to do any extras, if you, anything, traveling there, flying, driving, parking, any questions that you could possibly come up with, please let me know. I have a trip coming up in July. It is budget friendly. It is the bare necessity trip. We are like breaking it down as simple as possible. It is going to be my daughter and I, so I will be traveling with a child She's 11, so, you know, she's technically a Disney adult. But, so, I will have that experience as well. I mean, I have that experience anyway because I travel with the kids all the time. But this is more budget-friendly. We are going before she starts middle school and just having one last, you know, good mommy-daughter trip before she starts middle school and goes into that chaos that will ensue. So, if you have any questions, please let me know. Once again, you can email me, you can comment on this video, you can message me. I am changing my Facebook page today, I believe, so I will probably post a video about that as well, but that's all I have for this video, very short and sweet video. Next week will be a little bit longer, and hopefully my dining room is nice and cleared off. We had science fair projects all over the place. And then I can begin filming again, which would be absolutely lovely. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.